Is this really all they had to worry about? Boys? Movies? Deciding which shirt goes with which skirt? It's bizarre. <laughs>Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of The Last of Us Remastered. Well, you saw last episode. We're alone now. It's just Ellie and I. There's a good reason for that. Sam turned. Henry shot him. Save Ellie. Blame Joel. And then shot himself. My brain still just boom. Exploded. I can't process it. I get it. Like, I understand why Henry did it. Sam was his reason to live, his his reason to keep going, to keep fighting, and he just lost that. So, why would you keep going if the person that you were living for is no longer there? Yes. Partially. It could have been our fault. It was my job to protect them, but the runners came out so quick that, I mean... We did the best we could. We fought. That's what we do in this game. We fight. Fight to the end. So, <sighs> okay. Now that we're done thinking about that. Very sad, I know. Let's move on, though, right? We got more game to play. <laughs> I can't just stand here and cry about Henry and Sam forever. But, you know, the game really just gets you so attached to these characters. And then that final cutscene with them all sitting there by the fire, you think, oh man, you know, we're gonna all make it successfully, and then boom, that happens. Even though I knew, like I knew Sam got bitten, I could tell, right, when that runner knocked him down, you could just tell that he got bitten. Okay, anyway, moving on. We're now in Jackson County, and with a little bit of Google research, <laughs> we were in Pittsburgh, right? With Henry and Sam trying to get out. And now we're in Wyoming. So if you Google that, right? Pittsburgh to Wyoming, that's 573 hours of walking distance. Um, it didn't show them. What are we doing? We're standing here, Ellie. I have to, I have to recap, stop. Didn't show them with a vehicle or anything. It literally just sh shot from Henry killing himself to here. Now we're in fall. So who knows how they got here, right? If they drove, it's 27 hours. So it's been, a, it's been quite, quite a while. But we do know that Wyoming is where uh, Tommy, our brother, should be, right? Because he's, he's going to be our saving grace, apparently. He, he's supposed to know something, what I'm supposed to do with this Ellie girl here. <laughs> so let's see what we can find. So this road. Yeah. Just follow the river. It'll lead us straight to Tommy's. Come on. But how do you know this? How do you know this? Hmm? How do you even know where Tommy is? Like, if I didn't have a GPS, I wouldn't know where the heck to go. Okay, are we following the river this way? What happened way? between you two? What do you mean? You and Tommy. You're not together, so clearly something went down. We just had a bit of a disagreement, that's all. Ah, here we go. So what was it about? <laughs> Tommy saw the world one way, I saw it the other. And that's why he joined the Fireflies. Yeah, your friend Marlene promised him hope. That kept him busy for a while, but just like Tommy, he eventually quit that too. How was it last time you saw him? I believe his last words to me were, I don't ever want to see your goddamn face again. Jeez. But he's going to help us? I suppose we're going to find out. Well, with or without his help, we'll get there. Let's just keep going. I love your positive attitude, Ellie. I'm glad that somebody here is not a Debbie Downer all the time. Okay, how the hell do I get down from here? He said follow the river, but I gotta get down to the river to follow it. Who knows what we'll encounter? Are they gonna be swimmers too? Are they gonna be freaking the Loch Ness monster just hiding in the water there? Waiting to take our souls? I think so. Probably. This game's so unpredictable. Which is actually really cool, I have to say. I love that... Like, you you kind of know what's going to happen. You just you get a feeling, right? Because we've all played or watched these kind of movies. 
So you kind of get what's going to happen. But at the same time, even though you know it's going to happen, the game still just tears at your heartstrings. And it still feels so unexpected, even though it's there's a hydroelectric power plant. expected. <laughs> I, a hydro -proof. It uh, uses the river's movement and uh, turns it into electricity. Let's do that. Look, I know what it is. I don't know how it does it. All right. How are we getting across? Good question. We'll find out, won't we? Because the L3 button will soon here tell me how to get across. <laughs> It'll be like, hey, look at this. This is the way to go. Private property. Oh, this game is so wonderful. You know, I have to say, guys, I know there's a lot of you out there who are watching these and following them. And I just want to say that I appreciate you. You know, your comments and your support have all been so wonderful. Do this twisty turny thing. Oh, is this supposed to be like a bridge to cross? Twist it, twist it, twist it. And then we gotta get to the other side and do the same thing. Huh? Well, that gets us halfway. If we get the other one up, we'll make it across. Um, can we cross the logs and then fall into the water? That sounds like a great idea. Well, at least Joel can swim, right? It looks like we can go into this door, so let's go in there real quick. There you go. There you go. Whoa, the goodies. Woohoo! Woo, woo, woo. Good, because we were out of ammo anyway. I still have yet to use my bow and arrow. I know. Despicable. It is despicable. I saw you jump over there. Well, at least they get a well needed shower. I don't want to go over there. I want to jump into the water. Huh. That's what I gotta do. I'll find something. Just hang tight. I can tell that their relationship has really grown since the beginning. And I can understand, again, Joel's hesitation to get an attachment to this girl. But at the same time, I can tell that he's finally decided to kind of open up. Okay, where am I going? I know I can dive. Oh, there we go. Hello, fishies. Ugh, I have to go in the building. I see it. It's right in there. It's right in the building. <laughs> we have. We have to go inside. Pull it out, don't we? How do we get in there? Hello. Here we go. We don't need to die. You are so cool, Joe. You know that he's like that redneck, redneck dad or uncle that everybody needs in their life. All right, I need you to. I know. Step on the fucking pallet. <laughs> We need to teach this girl how to swim. <laughs> you know, I was thinking about this just now. We know Joel and Sarah, they lived in a home, right? But he has not once, that I can recall, mentioned a wife or a significant other or even just Sarah's mom. So I wonder what that's all about. I mean, him and Tess, I feel like they had a thing Don't for each other. Spin. Whether they acted on it or not, I think they definitely did. I mean, you, you, I think you have to, you grow an attachment to the people you hang around in, in a world like this because there's nobody else. It's not like you have plenty of fish in the sea to choose from. You just kind of grow an attachment to the person you're with. And if there's Be chemistry, I will. then it can progress, right? Teamwork. Aww, how sweet. <laughs> that was precious. Oh, that was so precious. Let's see what's down here. 
camp? There was camp down here. How long ago that was, we're not sure. Holy snap, we are out of healing kits. I mean, I know that I'm only limited to so many things. So do we go up or this way? We want to go the wrong way first. I guess we could. I know, I am too. Well, I see I'm totally shooting it. Let's get past this place, then we can scrounge up some food. Well, if I starve, you're responsible. <laughs> oh, yes, their relationship has definitely, definitely grown a lot. Oh, boy. Here we go. Uh, should we head in? Uh, ain't no way around. Gonna have to cut through the plant. We should definitely drive this. I think that's a great idea. Power plant map. All right, let's read it. <clears throat> North Tenton Power Networking. North Tenton Dam. Map of Jackson Power Plant. Okay. Thanks. Oh, man. Oh, a new gun. And it's even got a sniper. Or a scope on it. Hail to the yes. El Diablo. El Diablo. It only got one bullet. Does that mean we're going to need this? Probably. Out of ammo. Okay, let's figure out how to open this door, huh? Oh, look, we can just push it. Here we go. Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie, do as the lady says. Here we go. Hey. Please tell me you're lost. Oh, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? They're all right. But you know these people? I know him. He's my goddamn brother. Tommy. Holy shit. <laughs> How you doing, baby brother? Goddamn. Yeah. Let me look at you. You get fucking old. Easy. It's gonna happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am, thanks for not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother-in-law. We all gotta get wrangled up at some point. Aww. <laughs> Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh... That's kind of a long story. Why don't we bring him inside? Yeah. You hungry? Starving. Huh. False alarm! They're friendlies. Oh, they're friendlies. They've been raids. A lot of bandits in this area. It's been quiet for a few days. What the hell are you doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. Been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before, but one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joe. I had. We'll get her running again. Man, so we just went from, I don't want to freaking see you ever again, to, hey there, brother. And this is my wife. And they have a horse! No way. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. Sorry, I'll be right back. Can I? Yeah, of course. He likes when you cut his ears. You ever ride one? 
I actually have. When have you ridden a horse? Uh, Winston, this soldier back in the zone, he gave me lessons. You know, if you want, we can take him riding later. That'd be awesome. No oh, precious. There. Oh, I can pet it. Hey, thanks, Tommy. No sweat. All right, let's continue the tour. Oh, that was precious. Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> can I pet this butt too? Oh. Earl? Yeah? Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Hauser and the rest of the boys to relieve me. Oh, no. You know, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. Just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. All right, well, take it easy. So, I'm so glad to hear some companionship finally. Everybody has been so against each other. But these guys seem pretty cool. Maria. Yeah, go ahead. We're in the control room. Steve's about to start it back up. You want to come check it out? <sighs> I'd rather eat with Ellie. It's my turn anyway. I'll go. I'll come with you. Go with Maria. Get some food. Oh. Come on, Ellie. Let's give the boys some space. I'm sending Tommy over. Stand by. She seemed pretty this hurt about that. Six time of them trying to get the turbines back online. We've been here just a week, and it feels like forever. Uh, I got something for you. Last year I went back to Texas, back home. Most of our stuff is long gone. Most of it. Here. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. I'm good. What? You sure? I mean... I said I'm good. Okay. I'll hold on to it for you. Tommy, I... I need to talk to you. Privately. Yeah. Okay. Let me just check on my guys real quick. Come on. Why didn't we want a picture of our daughter? Wait, I want I want it. Just cause Joel does it, I want it. That is not okay, Joel. What's your deal? You gotta know what hurts, but you can still remember her. I don't get it. Somebody please clarify. <laughs> I don't know what you heard, but you should see the town. We're over 20 families strong now. It was Maria and her father. They set up this place with the idea of being self-sustained. We got crops and livestock. Remember how we thought no one could live like this anymore? We're doing it. Give it up. You ain't saving that turbine. What do you do for protection? The adults take turns guarding the perimeter. We even got an electrified fence when the plant's out. Hey, you still gotta deal with infected though, right? Who doesn't? But it's the world we live in. Or maybe you don't have to be. <laughs> you sound like Marlene. Oh, puppy. Hey, buddy. That's Buckley. <laughs> Not much of a guard dog. Oh, that's a good boy. Maybe good to have around. How oh, precious. So confused, though. I'm still hung up on the Sarah thing. Why he wouldn't want to take the picture. These two geniuses are gonna bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> you don't believe us? I didn't say that. I'll bet you a million bucks it works. Sure, make it two. Uh, we're almost ready. They just need to finish putting the shield back on. No luck. To the left. Watch it. They're all wearing hard hats. Where do they get those? Okay, that's good. Slowly. Slowly. All right, that's good. Tommy's here. You good to go? Jimmy, one second. Okay, good to go. Ready? Go ahead. Hit it. Here we go.
Yes, please make all the noise. See that? Pretty impressive. Looks like you're out two million bucks. <laughs> all right, Joe. Let's go talk. I don't want to. Now what's gonna happen? Oh. It's quite the crew you got here. Yeah, they're good men. This place gives them a second chance. Gives us all a second chance. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. <laughs> it's got everything to do with that little girl. Well, go on then. She's immune. Immune to what? Oh, come her, on. I know I've seen her breathe enough spores to take down a dozen men. And nothing. Now, I wouldn't have believed it neither. But I can show you. All right. I'll bite. Why bring her here? I'm supposed to deliver to the fireflies. The way I figure they're your boys. You finish the job, you collect the whole damn painting. I haven't seen a firefly in years. You know where they are. Now, I'm not asking for much, Tommy. I just want some simple gear, enough to set me on my way. He's gonna what trade Ellie? For, this for isn't gear? for me, Tommy. This is for your damn cause. My cause is my family now. You ain't talking about some walk in the park here. Jesus, boy. Have Maria get some of your born-again friends to do it. They got I, families, too. Tommy, I need this. You want some gear? Sure. But I ain't taking that girl off your hands. This is how you gonna repay me, huh? Repay you? For all those goddamn years I took care of us. Took care? That's what you call it? I got nothing but nightmares from those years. You survived because of me. It wasn't worth it. I bring you the cure from mankind, and you want to play the pissy little brother. We ain't back in Boston. You lay your hands on me again, it won't end well for you. The hell is that? We're under attack. You still remember how to kill, right? Yeah. Oh, my God. He wants to trade Ellie. Bandit! Stop him! Don't let him into the building! He wants to trade Ellie! For gear? Are you that selfish, Joel? What the hell are you thinking? And did you see the way that he walked away from her? And she just was so hurt that she, he was just like, you know, go with her, Ellie. I've got to go talk to my brother. Like... That was not cool. You guys have been through so much together. I don't understand. And then, I mean, maybe it makes a little more sense now why he didn't want um, the picture of his daughter because he knew he was going to ditch Ellie. Ryan. But I don't understand. I don't understand what he's going to gain from that. Somebody please tell me. Wait, don't tell me. <laughs> Game, please tell me. Oh, that's what I did. That guy is on fire. <sighs> we gotta get down. <clears throat> Can you get out of there? No, we're trapped. We're gonna come to you. Just stay. They're here. Ellie, hide. Maria. Ooh, God damn it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, wait a minute. We know Ellie can't die. Please don't tell me Maria's gonna die. And then Tommy's gonna hate us. And then he's gonna. <sighs> like, I don't wanna try to predict these things, but this is what's happening right now. I didn't even see you. Oh, 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 oh. Let me just set myself on fire, sure. <laughs> that was smart. I don't know what I was thinking there. 
Wasn't anything good, though. I keep seeing gunfire from up above. Unless it's just the ones coming from behind me. I thought you died. Would you die? Please. Oh my god. There's Tommy. Don't follow me. We gotta get to the need you. Right behind you. We go this way. This is a bottle. I think I'm just going back the way I came, to be honest. Got to get to the girls. Which way are the girls? Where'd you go, Tommy? <laughs> this way? I'm lost! Okay, wait. I know we've crossed this bridge. Oh, we went in that building. Duh. Duh, duh, Joe. What the hell was that? Did you see him move? That was not me. In the nutsack, B word. Ammo, pieces, stuff. Everywhere. Well, they move so fast in this game, I've already kind of forgot about Ellie, not Ellie, Henry and Sam. Now I'm just straight up worried about Ellie. Did you die? I know you're over here somewhere. Headshot. Tommy? For real? I'm all right. The kid's with me. Yeah, give me Ellie back. We're out of here. Oh, something's gonna happen. You okay? Yeah, 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 I'm fine. Oh, oh man, they were coming in from every direction, and then Maria was like, we gotta run, and so we dove over these tables, and this huge guy blasted with a shotgun. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Listen, then... hey, hey, are you hurt? No. God damn it. I need to talk to you. Is he gonna do Absolutely it? Absolutely not. You tell him to go find somebody else. Do you have any idea how many men we lost here today? Hey, what's that all about? Does that have anything to do with me? We'll talk about it later. Did he tell you where the lab is? We'll talk about it later. Later. Right. One fuck up. One fuck up and then I turn into one of those widows, okay? I have to do this. I don't know what else to say. Fine. Maria. Here we go. You. If anything, anything at all happens to him, it's on you. She's thankful, you know. Yeah, I know. I'll take that girl of yours to the Fireflies. You don't have to worry about it. It's best this way. No. You know, maybe some real good will come of this. I need to talk to Ellie. No, Joel. You're not Say leaving again, Ellie. Hear you. Joel! What, what is it? That girl of yours. She took one of our horses and rode off. <laughs> Which way? Come on. <laughs> She knew something was coming. Go back inside. Help the others clean the place up. Okay. Careful out there. Oh, I get to ride a horse, sweet. Where's she going? Yeah. She knows something's going on. Okay, how do I make you go faster? Hey, ya. Hi, ya. Hi, ya. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Probably the button that's the same as my sprint button. How cool is this? Go, Joel, go! I thought you were sexy before, but damn! Cowboy! <laughs> she couldn't have gone far. We'll find her, don't worry. Stubborn kid. She usually pull these stunts. Nothing like this. What's going on? She's not stupid, Joel. She knows what's going on. 
She's a smart kid, very intuitive. And she's gonna find a way to change your decision. I know it. Oh, this is awesome. There's just a little bit of everything in this go game. Down this way. is thinking. What is, what is she planning? There. More tracks. Guess we'll find out, won't we? This music is incredible. I don't think I've ever said that. Like, I've... I've stop. I have praised the graphics and the story. The music is just as good. Like, they did so good on this game. Whoa, 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 whoa! How many do you see? Too goddamn many. Where? Where's Ellie then? Go the around, hell? Please you. don't tell me that they caught her. Ellie! Is that somebody behind there? That's just a plant. <laughs> That's like, wait a minute. Hey, I hit. Does it give me that shiny thing? Because I'm on easy mode and it's like, here, this is the guy that's shooting at you. <laughs> I think it definitely does. It probably does not do that if you're not on easy. I knew you were behind there. I swear I saw something move. Heads up! No, no. Oh, 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 I don't have anywhere to hide. Ah. Bitch. Yeah, that hurt. That was my bad. I took too long to aim. But I got you. Hey, health. Health, hallelujah. Eat my hatchet. Yes. I have so many weapons. I wonder how he carries them all. It's gonna be heavy. Like, I'm a technician, right? So I carry a tool belt around on my hips all day. But on your, like, carrying something on your hips really isn't that bad. But carrying around a backpack full of a bunch of weapons and ammo and stuff, that would get really heavy. And I'm probably thinking way too far into this. It's just a game, but I'm just saying it would be. So did I lose my horsey? Did it die? Where are you? Oh, there was ammo. I think it said full. Okay, there's horse tracks. Where'd you go, Tommy? We didn't come from this way. Where the heck? I need to get my horse, don't I? Horsey, where are you? Oh, there's Tommy. Come on. Back to the horses. Hey, they're smart horses. They knew. They knew. Wow, guys. Ellie ran off. That's so sad. Hey. Like, I'm tempted to end the episode here, but I want to see what happens. I don't want to stop yet. <laughs> like, I try not to make these way too long. Tracks keep going this way. Just hope they didn't get to her. Hope they didn't get to her. She's a smart girl, Joel. I don't think anything got to her. Mainly because she's the main character. <laughs> I 
love this so much. It's beautiful. It's peaceful. Even though we got ambushed, it is still just kind of a breath of relief from the normal having to constantly be on your toes. We just did it so right. And a horse! It fits Joel very well. He's obviously done this before. Look, by the ranch. That's our horse. She's gotta be there. Let's go. Hidden Plant Pines Corral. The area looks clear. Do we get a ride by horse now? That'd be cool. Where are we going? Okay, here we go. Let's see what's going Be on careful. in Ellie's head. Ellie? Ellie? She's all nonchalant about it. Yeah, in just a second. Let me, let me get some stuff first. And then we'll go take care of this Ellie business. What was she thinking? Where are you? Oh, there's him. Ellie. I heard you say up here. What are you, out the window? Taking a bath? Where are you? The heck? She's in that very last door, isn't she? There's a lot of bathrooms in this house. Is this really all they had to worry about? Boys? Movies? Deciding which shirt goes with which skirt? It's bizarre. Get up. We're leaving. Come on. And if I say no? Do you even realize what your life means? Huh? Running off like that, putting yourself at risk? It's pretty goddamn stupid. Well, I guess we're both disappointed with each other then. What do you want from me? Admit that you wanted to get rid of me the whole time. Tommy knows this area. Oh, better fuck than... that. Well, I'm sorry. I trust him better than I trust myself. Stop with the bullshit. What are you so afraid of? That I'm going to end up like Sam? I can't get infected. I can take care of myself. How many close calls have we had? Well, we seem to be doing all right so far. And now you'll be doing even better with Tommy. Not her, you know. What? Maria told me about Sarah. Ellie? And... You are treading on some mighty thin ice here. I'm sorry about your daughter, Joel, but I have lost people too. You have no idea what loss is. Everyone I have cared for has either died or left me. Everyone fucking except for you. So don't tell me that I would be safer with someone else because the truth is I would just be more scared. You're right. You're not my daughter. And I sure as hell ain't your dad. Joel. And we are going our separate ways. Get it together. We're not alone. I got two walking in. There's more inside already. Joel is an asshole. Joel, you're an asshole. I can't believe it. Why is he being like this to her? Like, I get it, his daughter. 
but his daughter's gone. He needs to move on. Ellie's the one he needs to protect now. And he's just so set in his way of separating with her. And I don't understand why. And my eyes are watered again. Stop. <laughs> I don't need to water any plants today, okay? <laughs> Alright, guys. I'm in an episode here. Obviously, we've run into a dilemma. Um, Joel is just ready to give her up. Ready to send her off with Tommy to find the lab. And then what's going to happen in the lab? They're just going to take her apart and test her and probe her and prop her. And it's not okay. It's still inhumane even in a world like this. Okay, anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like and subscribe. And I hope to see you around next episode.